It's easy to make a deal with the devil, but getting out of that deal? That's a trick that only the devil himself can teach you. I get you. I'm going down to see Big Boss, Johnny. Yeah. He's busy right now. Um, take a seat. Joe will get you a drink, and uh, I'll let him know you're here.
more job for me. What do you got to lose? Come on, son. Busy man, playing a serious game of solitaire. Patience. That's the old school name. Solitaire. French referred to it as success. Dates back to Napoleon. He played it during his exile, I know. Isn't that nice? You remember the details? Yeah, I'll listen to you. I always have. Johnny! Bring us a couple of bourbon rocks. You keep the rocks and make mine neat. Yeah, I remember things. I remember what I like to drink. Does that come as some surprise to you? You know, some people meditate to ease their minds. I play cards. Did you come in here to bust my balls about that? I just don't have time to wait around anymore. Last job got under your skin. Do you remember what I taught you? Yeah, you taught me a lot. You did. You did. Sins of the father, sins of the son. Well, what the fuck do you want? We talked about it already. I'm tired of the cold. It's time I got out of the driving rain. Okay, sure. Okay, fucking rain. Mm -hmm. There's this new casino outside of Reno. It's Indian, but Vegas runs it. They found some chief from some, I don't know, res. He acts as sort of a, sort of a front guy. But chief, he doesn't read the small prints. Starts acting like he owns the fucking place. Vegas wants him out. They try to keep it civil, but the chief, he keeps bringing up this clause from some law, some, some tribal sovereign fucking nation thing. Huh? So? Well, it's gotta come from the outside. And it probably ought to look like some tribal grudge. I was gonna send Johnny, but uh, you go, you go instead. You go out there, you go sit in the sun, you relax for a while. You do this one, it's good for both of us. My last job was my last job. I'm not looking for another. I'm looking to move on. Move on? <laughs> what the fuck are you talking about? Move on, move on to what? I need you to release me. Bodhi, I understand. Shit happens. Job can get to you. But what you have to remember is, what you must keep foremost in your mind is you actually did a good deed. You know what that degenerate prick was into? Don't be fucking believable, sick as it gets. You did the kid a favor, you saved him a lot of pain. His mom? Junkie, skank, prostitute, doesn't even remember she had a kid, and his dad, who the fuck knows? So the kid gets to hang with this sick old fuck Uncle Bob, who's already made a deal to sell him to this fat... Jesus, sick as it gets. Just let it go. The kid will get over. just like you did. You think I'm over it? You don't think I wonder about how things would have gone if I had... If, if, if fucking what? If I hadn't taken you off the street and put you to work, what? If, if a fucking frog had wings, he wouldn't bump his ass every time he jumped. If, if, fuck. You turned out pretty good. I turned out to be the kid without a dad, grew up to be the son of the gun. Killed some other kids' only family. That's not so good. All right, all right. Maybe I should have sent you to school. We could teach you to count, count your goddamn blessings, which are add up to a hell of a lot more than a few dead bodies. You wouldn't have jack shit if I hadn't rescued your off from the ass. All right, go ahead. Turn your back on me. Go on. 
Go on, get the fuck out of here. Go home to that smart stripper of yours and whatever else you got fucking stashed away. I'll let you know what your next move is. Don't think you can come fucking waltzing in here anytime and interrupt my game. So if I owe you everything, you get the blame too, right? Johnny. All right. Johnny, put the gun down. Come on. Bodie and I just have a little heart to heart, you know? Family stuff. I'll tell you what, Bodie. How about we play a game we both can play? Hmm? Johnny, put the gun down. Come on. Hmm? One hand, you and me, all in. You win, I release you. And if I lose? Well, then you do one more job for me, no questions asked. Come on, put your ass down here. What do you think? What? You think you got a choice here? What, you want to kill me? Johnny would splatter your brains all over the bricks so fast you'd think he was Jackson Pollock. Come on, sit down. What do you got to lose? Even if I win, it's one more job. Come on. What's a kid doing awake anyway? I mean, it's supposed to be asleep. It's 3 a.m. in the morning, am I right? It's really bad luck. Little kid. Wakes up just in time to see you cut Uncle Bob's throat. Really bad luck. But you know, he sees you. If he sees you, well, that means it points back to me. We can't have that. That's that's unacceptable. The deck is closed. I don't kill kids. I didn't think you did either. He stopped being a kid when he saw what you did. He's a witness now, he's all grown up. The kid is as old as he's ever gonna get. What you got? You know, I don't think you shuffled the deck. What? Sins have sins. 